this is a uh, pretty well kind of like an open air semi uh, enclosed uh, museum. The only punishment is that you have to sign my guest book. And you know, I, I really uh, I welcome everyone here just to look around and uh, sometimes uh, I see uh, some people find out that my statues uh, cost more than five dollars a piece. So I think a lot of people th assume that they only cost about five, ten dollars a piece and then I, I hear someone say like, Martha, Martha, let's get out of here. He's got to sell us something. You know, actually, I tell people like this, don't worry, it's okay. You may have to twist my arms to buy one of my pieces, but don't feel you have to buy anything. You're welcome, just kind of look around, and hopefully you'll, you'll look at uh, my, my real work, because I consider all these statues here my insignificant little pieces. The Spring Giants, my humanitarian statues, are the only thing, only thing that's important about my work, because these statues honor uh, the people that have uh, faced a lot of injustices and like for instance the last that Whispering Giants I finished was in 2008 last summer in 2008 and that statue was along the Danube it's a medieval king honoring King Stephen the Hungarian king that introduced and brought his uh, his Magyar uh, tribe of in, uh, people uh, that's my tribe, is the Magyars. He brought them into the European Christianity uh, nation. Uh, so that's a statue that, uh, you know, I was honoring the Magyar people because they have faced a lot of injustices, you know, and especially when I was a child, the Russian communists came in and they massacred uh, the Hungarian people. It can be physically and especially emotionally exhausting because what I do in regards to especially the Indians, Kelly, is I study each of the giant logs uh, until I can visualize the Indian within and then what I do is uh, I try to intertwine the spirit of the tree with the spirit of the Indian. The statue in Alaska is almost, a giant statue is almost as wide as this one is tall, so this is uh, a fairly small statue in comparison wise. There's a lot of parallel between the American Indians and my people because we have both faced a lot of injustices. And, uh, but I, I made these statues because I love America. America is the best country in the world.